two. Hi, this is Patrick with MT Knives, and I'm here with my daughter Lily. Lily, say hi. Hi. And uh, we're going to make some mayonnaise for you today, because uh, I had some requests. Some people wanted to know how to make mayonnaise, or how I made it. Now, the best way to make mayonnaise uh, is with a stick blender. It's pretty well foolproof. And what you want to do is you want to add your ingredient with a stick blender. You can add all your ingredients, and you can stick that stick blender down to the bottom of the cup, turn it on, pulse it, and you'll see it start to turn to mayonnaise. And then slowly bring your stick blender back up. And I've never had it not work with a stick blender. Now, using a blender or a food processor is a little more difficult because the trick is you can't add the oil too fast. If you add the oil too fast, it won't turn into mayonnaise. So, I've got a little trick that I'm going to try, and I think it'll work really well. And what I've had the idea of doing is taking a Ziploc bag, putting my oil in it, and putting a small hole in the bottom of the bag. That way, it will slowly drip into the blender. Now, uh, the if you try to pour the oil from a container such as this, and you can do it, but you have to make sure that you pour it real slow, just a slow drizzle into the blender. And so I'm going to try this to see if it makes it a little easier. The other, uh, now this recipe calls for, there's lots of recipes online. You can look up mayonnaise recipes and you'll find all sorts of recipes. Um, what I'm going to do today, it's a half teaspoon of mustard, a four teaspoon of salt, two eggs, two tablespoons of white vinegar, which I'm going to use this red vinegar because that's what I have, and two cups of oil. And I'm actually going to cut the recipe in half. Just I just made mayonnaise, so we're just going to do this for demonstration purposes. Now what you want to do is put all your ingredients except for the oil in the blender, really. We're going to do a fourth a teaspoon of mustard. Half. No, the whole thing. Here, let's use the lid. Let's use the lid. I'm just going to scrape it off. Just a bit. Put it in the pitcher. And then a fourth a teaspoon of salt. Just half of that in salt. That's good. Two eggs. We're going to just do one. And we have our own eggs on the farm. I think it makes the best mayonnaise. A lot of recipes just call for the yolk, but this is a recipe you can use the whole egg. And a tablespoon of vinegar. You want to hold that over the thing? A tablespoon. That's a teaspoon, eh? nice thing about the blend tech is it's got this lid that comes off. This will make a mess. It splashes a lot. So I'm going to put the lid on and I'm going to set this bag right on top of the lid so when it splashes it's not splashing all over our house. Can you pour that? You want to hold the bag? Help me hold the bag. So. Okay. Now, you want to do this on a medium speed, and on my blend tack, I just am going to do it at, like on setting three.
to say about the blend tank, it shuts off after about 50 seconds. <laughs> See, it's nice and thick. See? So, 
there you have it. The plastic bag works really well, or you can try to slowly drizzle it in. If it don't turn out, you probably added your oil too fast. Um, if you want a foolproof way, the stick blender I've never had mess up. We actually, I was going to show you that way, but this is the most difficult way, so I figured I'd show you how to do it in case you don't have a stick blender. Thank you for watching. I hope uh, this has helped you learn how to do uh, one more thing for yourself, and uh, we really enjoy knowing what we're eating and and uh, being able to save some money at the same time. Uh, you know, we have our own eggs and doesn't cost a whole lot for the oil and the seasonings. If you want mayonnaise, Miracle Whip, something like that, you just add some more seasonings. I like to add a little bit of cayenne or um, some paprika or stuff like that into it and make it spice it up. So you can just uh, have fun with it. Thank you for watching. Lily, you want to tell everybody goodbye? Bye. Have a good day.